Welcome to Tesla Vision. Today we will talk about the most recent Tesla news and updates. Let's get into it. Right away, Tesla's officially submitted an expanded application for construction permits in order to build more facilities in Grünheide, south of Berlin. The most notable addition will be a battery cell factory. The Ministry of Agriculture, Environment and Climate Protection of the state of Brandenburg announced on the 3rd of June that Tesla's revised its application for construction permits at the Giga Berlin production facility. According to the ministry, Tesla wants to add a battery production facility there. Tesla's been planning to build a major battery manufacturing facility in the vicinity of its Giga Berlin for quite some time now. Since the very first announcement of the plans for Giga Berlin proper back in 2019, the facility has been thought of as Tesla's Europe operations hub. In July of 2021, Tesla intends to start Model Y production at its Gigafactory Berlin, with the vehicles made there being exported across the European continent to meet the growing demand for Tesla EVs. Tesla electric vehicles are popular in several European countries, including Germany, France and Norway. As the demand for Tesla EVs continues to surge, the EV maker needs to continue expanding its battery production operations. In its press release, the Ministry of Agriculture, Environment and Climate Protection of the state of Brandenburg talked about the company installing corresponding auxiliary device for vehicle production. According to the agency, the planned battery production facility could have an estimated manufacturing capacity of 100 gigawatt hours per year. However, this capacity could be increased to between 200 and 250 gigawatt hours per year. The automaker is expected to produce 4680 lithium ion cells at this new facility. The new, in house developed 4680 type cylindrical cell was unveiled at the Battery Day event last September and is expected to give Tesla cars an extended range, more power, and performance than the previously used 2170 type cylindrical cells. Tesla's been aware that the 4680 lines in Berlin will not take care of the initial production phases at the factory. Instead, it will rely on suppliers and its it's Cato Road 4680 lines in the United States to take care of the first months of production at Giga Berlin. In addition, amended application documents included changes to plant design to minimize water consumption at the facility. The water supply to the factory was one of the more talked about issues by environmental groups and concerned citizens, which is why Tesla intends to reduce the water consumption. According to Axel Steffen, department head of the Environment Ministry, Tesla will have to make changes to the design of the facility by using shallow foundations for some buildings and laying off supply lines above the water table. This will keep water consumption at the facility as low as possible. So far, the automaker has been constructing the new facility in accordance with preliminary building permits, yet the construction of the plant battery factory near Berlin is already well underway. Meanwhile, in a separate story, Tesla is reportedly exploring plans to bring its all-electric Model 3 sedan to India in the coming months for testing approvals, according to the latest local news. Reports about Tesla's entering India emerged back in February of 2017, when Tesla CEO Elon Musk said he had been hoping to launch sales in the Indian automotive market. These rumors gained momentum in late 2020, when a top Indian minister met with some Tesla executives. Tesla finally made moves in early 2021 after Nitin Gadkari, India's transport and highway minister, confirmed the automaker's approval to start operations with sales of its Model 3 sedans and then to potentially proceed to assembly and manufacturing. The company initially registered its subsidiary Tesla India Motors and Energy in Bengaluru, but due to some government regulations and hefty taxes imposed on imported vehicles, not many Tesla electric cars are present there. However, the automaker's been in discussions with relevant authorities and was believed to have applied for and obtained several business licenses for an important plant in Maharashtra, according to some documents previously released by India's Ministry of Corporate Affairs. So far, so good. Tesla's taken a couple of relatively large steps to establish a presence in the world's second most populous nation and fifth biggest car market. The company's hired several high-ranking employees and automotive industry veterans for its operations in the country. For instance, the company hired David Feinstein, who has been working with Tesla for more than nine years as Director of Global Trade and New Markets in India. Vaibhav Taneja has been appointed as the company's Chief Accounting Officer. 
The company also brought on Prashant Menon for the role of Director of Tesla's India Operation, Manoj Hurana for Policy and Development, Chintra Thomas for Human Resources, and Nishant Nishant for Charging Infrastructure. The EV maker recently added another member to its executive team for its EV operations in the country. Tesla hired Samir Jain to take the position of Regional Service Manager in India. Before his appointment, Samir was head of after sales and network development for Porsche in Mumbai, where he was responsible for network steering and dealer business management. Now, we are learning that Tesla is set to bring Model 3 vehicles to India by July or August for testing in a move that will see the electric sedan ready for sales before the end of 2021, according to India's CNBC affiliate TV18. The rationale behind Tesla testing its Model 3s in India is to have the vehicles approved by the Automotive Research Association of India. The ARAI is a body in India responsible for testing vehicles for crash safety, emissions, and other important automotive metrics. The Tesla Model 3 is expected to undergo all these tests before it can be allowed to go on sale before the end of 2021. The Indian government is pushing car companies to switch to electric alternatives and fast-track innovation and manufacturing of batteries in a bid to curb air pollution and cut its oil expenditures. In September of 2017, the government claimed that 30% of all the vehicles in the country should be electric by 2030. Tesla could go a long way to help India achieve its goals. Some sources in India claim that several Model 3 EVs have already been delivered to Mumbai for testing and more could be on the way. According to CNBC TV 18, Tesla is also planning to set up at least four showrooms in major metropolitan areas like Delhi, Mumbai and Bengaluru. All these three cities are crucial to Tesla's success, thanks to their highest number of individuals who are millionaires and billionaires. Tesla may consider a franchise model for after-sales workshops in the country. Showrooms are the automaker's dealerships, where its employees help arrange for test drives, do product demonstrations, and secure orders. While the Tesla executive team in India is currently composed of just a handful of members, Tesla will continue to recruit for several other senior positions, including sales and marketing head as well. The automaker will look to expand the team within the next few months, and the senior leadership will operate out of Mumbai, the report claimed. Furthermore, the pace of the project will be slow, but a calculated move. The automaker will go slow with the plans, testing its sales and demand in major cities before launching its operations to other parts of the country. India has emerged as one of the world's largest battlegrounds, where companies such as Hyundai, Mercedes and Tata Motors have already established their presence. However, like elsewhere in the world, Tesla seems to have a more established consumer base in the country, as Mr. Musk has amassed tens of millions of EV enthusiasts in the region. The same report suggests that the automaker could launch its indie design studio on its official website by the end of this year. Thereafter, testing phase of the Model 3 in India, orders could kick in to open up to potential Tesla buyers. Still, deliveries for the electric sedans may not happen until late 2022 or early 2023, as the automaker will have to establish more productions in the country. However, there is a back-end project already in progress by Tesla to have the vehicles ready for approval, as well as the potential sales by the end of the year. As of now, there are limited details of when Tesla will begin constructing a gigafactory or a production plant in India, but it's likely coming in the next few years. The company is currently working on completing its production facilities in Berlin and Austin. These giga plants will be up and running by the end of the year with a limited production. However, the mass production is expected to kick off early in 2022. Make sure to check out one of the videos shown on your screen right now. We post videos daily, so feel free to subscribe and stay up to date on all most recent news and updates.